Peggy 18. Hey there, assassins. It's time for another video dex. I'm your comm dev, Yubi Gabe. Let's first talk about the upcoming DLC, which will contain both multiplayer and single player content. Finally, right? We're offering brand new single player content called The Da Vinci Disappearance, in which Ezio must solve the mystery surrounding the kidnapping of his good friend and personal gadgeteer, Leonardo Da Vinci. In order to solve the mystery and find Leo, Ezio will have to work with Leo's assistant, Salai, and visit Lucrezia Borgia in all new locations, including Bel Rigardo, a castle in Ferrara, and the Pythagorean Temple. Being an achievement trophy hound myself, I am delighted to announce that the Da Vinci Disappearance will come packed with 10 new ones specifically for single player, so you'll have more opportunities to pad your gamer cred with this DLC release. But wait, there's more! <laughs> we're putting a new gameplay feature into the Thieves' Hideout. It's a dice game called Hazard that is actually from the 16th century. We also have some good news for the completionists among you, because the Da Vinci Disappearance will come packed with the Harlequin and Officer multiplayer personas, as well as the Helmschmied Draken armor. We're even going to unlock content that was previously only available in the Collector's Edition, Trajan Market, and the Aqueduct. And before you pre-orders and CE buyers get all cranky, be fair. You've had that content for months. Let's let everyone have access to it. You think we're done? Far from it, assassins. Because I haven't even gotten to the multiplayer updates, which is our largest update yet. First, Animus Project Update 3.0 will introduce a new map, Alhambra. Alhambra is located in an especially lush portion of Spain, and the map balances multi-leveled outdoor and indoor areas. If you thought Pienza had a lot of nooks and crannies, well, <laughs> you haven't seen Alhambra yet. Second, we're packing four new multiplayer characters into APU 3.0. The Damarosa is a lethal beauty, a deadly Black Widow spider who kills quickly and quietly. The Knight is an armored brute wielding a titanic greatsword to fell his enemies. The Marquis takes his costume advice from the mercenary and his murderous methods as well. Finally, we have the Pariah who hides his disfigured face behind noble finery and a porcelain mask. Third, we are pleased to offer two new modes with Animus Project Update 3.0, Escort and Assassinate. Think of Escort as a kind of mobile chess capture, where one team attempts to protect a VIP target from another team hunting that target. Points are awarded for killing the VIP with additional points for extra style, and for getting a VIP to their assigned destination. Meanwhile, Assassinate charges six to eight players to identify and execute other Templars, who are marked on your compass as potential targets. The twist is that you must lock your target in order to secure your contract in this free-for-all mode. Of course, all this great DLC does not come without cost, so the Da Vinci Disappearance will run you 800 Microsoft points, or 9 euro 99 on PS3. The Da Vinci Disappearance is slated for release on PSN on March 9th, and for Xbox Live on March 8th. See you soon, assassins. <laughs> and I was rolling. <laughs>